Hello, this is Frank with How Do I Hacks, and today we're going to be going over our third Python video, which is getting user input. So we're going to go ahead and launch Idle, and before we begin, one of the reasons why I use Idle is because in Idle you can make mistakes without having to go back versus if I were actually writing a program right now, I, every single time I made a mistake, the program wouldn't completely run. So I can just be setting variables in idle, like x equals 0, then click x and it comes up, versus if I do x equals k, and then I do something like that, it will not, k isn't defined, so in an actual file I would have to go back and fix that. So now on to the main topic, getting user input. In Python 3.30, which is what I'm using to show you, you're going to type in input, I-N-P-U-T, parentheses, apostrophe, then type the prompt, and my prompt will be, what is your name? And then you always put a space after the colon, or the question mark, or the exclamation mark, and then you do an apostrophe and a closed parentheses. And it'll say, what is your name? My name is, my name is Frank. And then see, it goes ahead and reprints it. And then another thing you can do is you can set variables to get user input. And like you learned in, burial, in basic math, sorry, a variable is anything that contains value. But in programming, a variable can, in Python at least, a variable can be letters or numbers. So x equals input, parentheses, apostrophe, what is your hair color? Apostrophe and parentheses brown. x equals brown at that point. So there you go. That's how you get input in 3.3. I know in versions 2.0 you're going to want to, not in 2.0, but in whatever version of 2 if you're using 2 for some reason, you're going to want to do raw input, apostrophe, and then your prompt, and apostrophe. And then it'll go ahead and go through, but in 3.3 it'll just go ahead and run an error code because that has recently been changed, taking out the raw and the underscore. Alright, well, see you guys in the next video.